You're watching Action News 5 at 4. Across the nation, millions are trying to tackle their weight worries. We'll show you how the FDA says you could be on the verge of a new diet pill boom next. The Food and Drug Administration says new science can revolutionize the diet pill industry. Recent advances in nuclear medicine have companies trying to bring new drugs to the market. Action News 5 Washington News Bureau reporter Brendan Cullerton spoke to the FDA about the process. An FDA scientist says in the next five to ten years, you can expect a pill that will make those with obesity crave food less, using methods we have not tried before. America's struggle with obesity has the FDA's attention. This can result in uh, premature death, can result in uh, diabetes, it can result in basically damage to your joints. CDC data shows more than 4 in 10 Americans are obese. FDA Director of Radiation Medicine Louis Marzella says a recent study using nuclear medicine showed the medical community how obesity impacts the brain. These nuclear medicine studies are showing that it, you know, it's not a problem with uh, willpower. It's really an actual disease. It's actually, you can see that the brain has been modified. Seeing what obesity does to people's brains, Alabama Advanced Imaging Director John McConathy says doctors will eventually be able to better decide how to treat different patients. I could see this entering clinical trials. Uh, again, it could be changing people's lifestyle or behavior, could be changing diet, or it could be a drug. Drugs like Ozempic and Wegovy have become popular for losing weight, but Marzella says those work by changing metabolism and slowing food movement through our intestines. He thinks the new understanding of the brain will lead to better results. Leading to therapies which will be much more effective because they will get at the root of the problem. The FDA works with drug companies to make treatments safe for public consumption. Marzella anticipates a rush to get new diet pills on the market. There's a uh, frankly, money to be made. There's, so drug companies will be attracted to this finding and they will work and compete with each other to develop new treatments. That study on how obesity impacts the brain was shown by a team from Leipzig University in Germany during a nuclear medicine conference in July. Physicians say more research is required before treatments can be developed. In Washington, I'm Brendan Cullerton.